Recording Modes Overview In BrainWave 4, there are three different types of recording modes available. When we go to the Controls panel and click the Recording drop-down menu, we can see that there are Events Recording, Raw and Events Recording, and Compressed Recording. To modify and select the different modes, click the Settings gear here. Here, we see that the default mode enabled is the raw data recording mode. We see that the biocam is in blue and has been enabled, and the blue pathway here represents the recording pathway. Here, we see that compression is gray and thus has been disabled, as well as channel validation. Thus, the recording will go from the biocam directly to a BRW file. By clicking the drop down menu and going to compressed, we can enable the compressed recording mode. Thus, the pathway also allows for channel validation and compression settings before exporting to the BRW file. As we will discuss in later videos, clicking on one of these blue boxes will allow us to adjust the settings for each option. Now going from co the compressed mode to the events mode, this pathway is set up to export directly to a BXR file, and no BRW file will be recorded. Thus, only the data that we have chosen will be recorded. So for instance, channel validation is enabled, as well as spike detection. The fast oscillations filter has been disabled. If we wish to enable LFP detection instead of spike detection, we can click the gray LFP detection box and click Enabled here. Now we see that the pathway has been updated to go from Biocam to Channel Validation to LFP detection and then exporting all of the data into a BXR file. If we wish to record both the raw data and perform an analysis in real time, we can go to the recording mode and change to Raw and Events. Here we see that the direct pathway to the BRW file has been enabled as well as the BXR file. This recording mode is the most time effective as you can create the raw data files as well as analyze them at the same time. Once we have selected our desired recording mode and adjusted our settings, as we will discuss how to do in further videos, click OK. Now we see that our recording option has changed from just raw to our raw in events. Clicking this button will enable the recording and begin the process. And again, if we want to change to the raw, we can click the drop down menu and our previously seen pathway will be employed. The same will go for the compressed and then clicking once more will enable the recording. 